What's up everyone? Just wanna show you guys how to fix uh, the rocket soda if uh, some of you guys out there have uh, the same problem. Uh, the mousepad tends uh, sometimes after six months, probably for other people, probably uh, one one, to uh, bend a little out of the side and in the corners and probably also almost in, in the middle. And in this quite annoying when you're gaming and suddenly you're driving your mouse, not driving, but uh, gliding your mouse over this bottle, like whoop, a little bit down and that back again. And I figure out a way how to fix this. And here we go. Um, you can use a piece of clothes or something uh, and put over it, you know, and uh, use a iron and glide it out slowly. And of course the iron, mine is up at uh, full speed, or full heatness or whatever you want to call it. And um, you're gonna be going slowly up and down on the mouse pad itself. And after doing this for like, uh, it takes about um, two minutes or probably more to do this uh, to get it out correctly as I like smoothing out as I, uh, on the mouse pad itself. And after that, you're gonna be using a hook to uh, hold it up. So, um, yeah, I'm just gonna be doing this. And at the meantime, I'm gonna be talking about what else I've been uh, using before this mouse pad. Um, back in 2010 I started using out, uh, started using um, um, Rocket Totem and before that I've been through like uh, 14 other mouse pads and I'm just gonna say three of them for example that I really really liked. There was uh, the glass mouse pad uh, from IceMat and I also got the one from SteelSeries. Uh, both of them were virtually the same company. Well, this now that is, and uh, then I had my hands on the aluminium mouse pad and the plastic one. My little brother really, really enjoy using uh, the plastic one from uh, Steel Series. But the main problem I had with it was um, with all three was that when there was coming uh, dust or anything else down, like hair or cat hair or whatever, down on the mouse pad, having a really, really good game, and when you're like. I'm just using the iron as an example for, for mouse. When, when you're like gliding your mouse over the mouse pad in a really good game and there's a hair on, on the middle of the mouse pad, the mouse will just go <laughs> over the mouse pad and you will have this nice little line of uh, whatever scratch into your mouse pad and that's freaking annoying. Um, and then back in 2010, uh, I went ahead and uh, saw some really, really good reviews about uh, uh, the Rocket Soda. And I was like a little bit skeptic. I'm really, really skeptic when it comes to mousepad. And I was like, well, what the hell? Let us try it out. And I must say, the Rocket Soda is probably one of the best, actually, it is one of the best mousepads that I have ever, ever used. Um, I also tried out the by one of my friends while well, actually while I was uh, holding the lane party, one of my climates uh, had uh, the Razor uh, Speeder, Speedy, uh, the huge one. With, it, with him, and I'm not into those uh, cloth mouse pad um, where you can like fold it down and have this you know, thing. Um, I like uh, plastic surface or whatever material it also as a looks closer to the plastic, but it is a special uh, material. To, it means me not saying that correctly. Uh, material, and um, the mouse is just flawless on uh, on this uh, mouse pad. It, it, the speed of it is just nice as a it's almost before you, so it's actually like this one when you have your mouse laying on and of course you need to have a nice clean surface on your mouse itself, well that's a little bit of hair here, but um, usually I have my mouse really really clean on uh, beneath it and uh, when you put your mouse on it and blow air on it's like gliding, so it's a really 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 amazing mouse pad. So now I've been doing this for like uh, 3 minutes or so. And uh, actually seems to be way more smooth. Actually, this is uh, a couple of hours ago as well. Just when I'm gliding out totally on the spots that I haven't uh, fixed yet. The thing you're gonna do now is um, uh, take a book, a huge book. Doesn't really matter if there's any knowledge in it, but uh, huge. Or you can use uh, the front side of a laptop or something huge. Just hold it down and in the position probably find something else instead of a book, but uh, that's uh, the only thing I can find at the moment. Um, 
I'm just gonna let it stay here for like uh, 10 minutes, probably 5 minutes uh, till it cools down. You can sh go ahead and shake on the mouse pad itself afterwards and that's that. So, um, hope you guys uh, enjoyed my uh, video and uh, stay tuned for upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. <laughs>